Now, what is it about female villains that makes us want to watch them wreak havoc on whatever poor, unsuspecting male or female is in their path? The fact of the matter is, we need them. We can't have a successful hero without a successful villain. And Isidingo provides us with some of the best villains on South African television. Now, she's a fiery redhead who's given Barker Haynes quite a run for his money and has also given us some of the steamiest moments on South African television. <laughs> We're talking to Marissa Drummond, better known as Kimberly Haynes. Hi, Marissa, how are thank you? Thank you, I'm very well, and thank you for having me. Um, so good to have you here. So I was a bit nervous about meeting you. I was like, I don't know Why? what I'm going to get. And you are actually so lovely That's in person. Lovely. Hey, nothing like the Kimberly <laughs> Haynes we see on no. TV. No, not at all. Not wow, at all. so tell us, what is it like to play such a fiery character? It's a fiery character. She's ballsy. It's lovely. Yeah. You know what? Um, I, I always got cast as the ditzy blonde mm -hmm. or just a romantic lead <laughs> or something like that. And I always craved yeah. to play something with a little bit more substance and layers and things like that. Yeah. So yeah. now it's it's actually a great privilege and I thank Isidinga for that. Now we were talking a, li a little bit before the time and I was mm. saying that I always get cast as the girlfriend or as the insignificant characters yes. and I actually stopped going because I want to play the bad girl. I want to play the villain. Yes. Um, so you've had quite interesting, you know, interactions with some of the males on our screen. And she is also responsible for some of the steamier roles on... on, on um, <laughs> some of the steamier scenes. <laughs> Tell us, what is it like? Because you've had some beautiful moments with Len and mm -hmm. with Daniel. Mm -hmm. What is it like to play those scenes? It's difficult. I won't lie to you. It is very difficult. Even though we all say it's it's technical, yeah. and it is. It's it's we we kind it's 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 like a choreographed dance, and we yeah. go by the beats, we go by the numbers. Yes. Um, but still, it's still your personal space. It's, but you know what? It, when you've got. Especially with, yeah. with, with Lane and Daniel, yes. with Chris Beasley and Stephen Fanico. We're all very good friends. Yes. And it's nice to walk on the floor yeah. and know that you're going there and you're going to feel secure with a male that you're on set with. Mm -hmm. And that's very important. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's very true. Mm -hmm. Now, um, with Isidinga moving to a later time slot, 7.30, mm -hmm. um, we have noticed that it's become somewhat darker. Yes. What can we expect from Kimberly in the months to come? <laughs> Even though she's a bit quiet at the moment, <laughs> she is. Yeah, there's always quiet before the storm. Oh. So and and even <laughs> though and now that we're at a seven thirty uh, airtime, uh, it's given the writers of Isidingo a little bit more you know, freedom mm, to give yes. us the little darker side of we everyone, like really. Like it, yeah. yeah, not only Kimberly, but everyone. Nice, yeah. so we should stay tuned then. Yes, yeah. absolutely. So let's move away from Kimberly mm. for a moment and come back to Marissa. You've yeah. had some really, really amazing things happen in your life, namely that she gave birth 11 months ago and you would never say. Tell oh, us thank about you. your baby girl. Her name is Annabelle Morgan. Oh. She was born on the 30th of August. She's the best thing that ever happened to my yeah. husband and myself. Um, she's a smiley, happy girl. She loves oh. the world. I said to her nanny the other day, I'm going to write her a song about, I love the world and the world loves me. And she oh. said to me, please don't write that song. <laughs> the kids will bully her at school oh, when she sings man. it. No, but she's absolutely gorgeous. She yeah. loves everyone. Yeah. yeah. Is she, are you much of a singer? I am. Really? Yeah, no, I, no, I sing professionally as well. You do? <laughs> okay, what can you not do then? Nothing. You There's want to nothing that I can't do. No, not at no, all. No, not, not right all. now. Too early. <laughs> we'll have to bring Marissa back to, to belt us out a couple of tunes. So a little bit later, we're going to be mm. talking about my top billing dream. You're going yes. to be on it tonight yes. um, with some interesting things. Do you want to give oh. us a sneak peek? I know Kat's <gasps> going to be talking to you about it a bit later. We gave them hell. <gasps> That's all I'm going to say. I like it. That's all we want to know. <laughs> now, Marissa, before we go, I just want to know from you, um, if anybody is looking to play a villainess on yes. South African TV, what is the three things that they should probably remember to play it well? Wow. Because it comes so easy to me, I don't know which three things you are <laughs> talking about. Because it comes about. so easy to me. Um, or maybe just one. Just believe in the character. Mm. You know, it's easy to believe in a goody two shoes. Yeah. It's not. A, it's not as easy to believe in a, in, a, in the baddie. Yeah. Just believe yeah. in the character and go That's for right. it. Yeah. Believe in the character. Absolutely. And of course, not. I don't know if a lot of people know. Yes, eindelijk Afrikaans spreken. I guess. I guess. I come from the Afrikaans. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but Kat's going to be taking talking to Marissa a little bit more. Are we going to be right back after this ad break? Don't go anywhere.